Pink Floyd concerts were always a multimedia event. As early as 1966, the group's live performances incorporated film. Projected onto a backdrop and onto the band. Before David Gilmour joined Pink Floyd as their guitarist, Sid Barrett held that position. But there was another guitar player too. Bob Close played on the group's first demos, before departing for a career in photography. He later worked with Gilmour on his 2006 solo album On an Island. Roger Waters came into the band as a guitarist too. But with Sid Barrett and then Bob Close on board, Waters moved from lead to rhythm guitar and then to bass. There was always this frightful fear that I could land up as the drummer, he once said. While their music has long been associated with mind-expanding drug use, besides Sid Barrett, the members of Pink Floyd only casually experimented with acid. In fact, they hadn't even tried whiskey until Janis Joplin passed them some during a tour in 1967. One of the band's roadies, Alan Stiles, provided the audio for Alan's psychedelic breakfast on 1970's Adam Hart Mother. Pink Floyd used actual recordings of Stiles preparing a meal in Nick Mason's kitchen. Stanley Kubrick asked to license the title track from Adam Hart Mother for the soundtrack to A Clockwork Orange. But Pink Floyd declined when the director indicated that he wanted to dismantle the song for use throughout the film. The dog on 1971 Seamus belonged to Steve Marriott. David Gilmour, who was watching the Irish Wolfhound while Humble Pie were on tour in the US, discovered it would howl when someone played a harmonica.